Ooh, don't go out of your way to dislike anybody we talk about in this video. Section 107 Fair Use allows us to talk about it, react on it, entertainment purposes only, and my opinion and my opinion only. Ooh, baby, it's Friday night and the weekend's here. I need to unwind. Where's the party? Hey, Jasmine was over there getting down one DJ, DJ, baby, what a party. What a party. When I tell y'all, I have been laughing at this for days and I've been waiting to do this video. When I tell y'all, this gave me, hey, we ain't got no babysitters, so bring them kids on to the party. Hey, y'all, we need to get turned. Our men ain't nothing, so bring the kids along and we're going to just try and figure it out as we go. When it is supposed to be uh, Phillip's mama's birthday and we rented a party van, hey, let's throw Caitlin's birthday in on it too because, hey, we ain't got money to do anything. Look, we bring in the whole crew. When I tell y'all it was inappropriate and funny at the same time, I don't even know what to say. I have been watching Foot on Neck and been laughing for days. When she said Aiden was up on that pole talking about some ski weed, baby, I about fell on out my chair. But we're going to go in and get into it. Jasmine, what a shame. Let me just say this. Everything that Jasmine does, her follow-up is, but that's the best I could do. I did what I could do with what I got. I did what I could do with it. Girl, boo-hoo. You would have been better off, okay, just allowing Caitlin to have that little gathering that you had at your house when you made the cupcakes, you gave her her gifts, and going on about her business. Because once you put her on that party bus, baby, you did it all the way wrong, backwards and sideways. First off, we know that all party buses have poles on them. And party buses usually have... Uh, you know, adult things going on in them. Y'all made it even worse to be sitting there with a tutu on. I was like, uh, is that Philip baby mom with a tutu on taking shots in the background? Y'all sitting there dressing up like it's y'all partying, like y'all some kids. It also very well showed that your child has absolutely no friends because a child that's a baby, a baby still should be having birthday parties with friends around, okay? Her only friends are her siblings or people that y'all go and scrape up that so-called family members and everything else because it makes absolutely no sense. You could have took that girl to get her hair done. Them braids been in her hair ever since school started. And with that Texas heat, baby, I bet you it's got some smells and some funkiness going on that can't nobody control, okay? You could have taken her to get her nails done. You could have took her shopping. You could have took her on a girl's day and asked her, hey, do you want to have a friend tag along and we can go have a girl's day? But I don't believe you want any friends around. You don't want her to have any friends around because guess what? Yeah, baby, they would see exactly what was going on in your house and it would not be nice. They would have to sit there and listen to legendary babble on with those tumbleweed ponytails on top of his hair. You know, rock and rough and stuff with those nappy afro puffs on his head. Also, they would have to put up with dogs and the smells and the roaches and everything else. What an embarrassment, okay? But you got this girl, and I do mean Caitlyn, on here posing with duck lips. Y'all playing all kinds of music, talking about, yeah, get down, get down, show down, twerk, do this, do that, do that. And then you want to get on here and tell us, oh, y'all always reported me trying to say that I got my dog, uh, my daughter having, you know, that uh, S-E-X-U-A-L uh, type of stuff going on on her channel, but you're going to sit here and tell me that kids of this age out here striking poses on the pole, that that ain't a bit uh, lewd and deceivious acts. Come on now. It don't make no absolute sense. I was sitting here and I was thinking to myself, you know, we know that Philip is a little whacked up in his brain and a little off, but then they always trying to paint Hannah that she's some saint and she's got it all together. No, because if you dating Philip, baby, you ain't got it all together. Look at all the baby mamas that he got popping out the woodworks and the channels they got and the issues they look like they got going on. So ain't nobody that's sleeping with him or dating him. Oh, got them all. Boy, the marbles are everywhere on the floor, baby. It is crazy. Okay. So let's just say that. But to allow all of this to happen, I was sitting there and I'm thinking, where Mama Dukes at? Where Mama Dukes? She got to be with Legendary because Mama Dukes ain't sitting there and she ain't drag her stool in there to sit down and bounce her tail around in the party bus. And I'm almost wondering when she was watching this, what she was thinking. What you had to put in, Jasmine, five cents or a dollar? Or was it something that somebody already else booked and you just said, we're going to get on here and we're going to tag along like you always do? Once again, shows you have absolutely no friends. You got to hang out with your baby daddies. Baby mama. <laughs> the baby mamas and the baby daddy girlfriends and things of that nature, they all got to hang out together because they all are miserable. I ain't never seen such a mess. 
such a mess. I mean, Aiden was so daggone ashy. He was jumping around. He was flipping around. Ava was lost in the sauce. Amaya was standing there like, please don't do this for my birthday next year. I don't want this. This ain't fun. What y'all think this is? And baby, everybody taking shots and getting a party on just to land at a restaurant and have a little bit of food and call it a day. You could have saved your money and done something a whole lot better. But as long as she can get on here and have an excuse, well, I did my best. I made, you know, good of what I had with what I had. And I had to do this and I had to do that. Girl, zip it. You needed to a break. You needed some time off. You needed to have a drink, but you had no babysitter. So you drugged those poor kids along with you to go along with that hot mess birthday party. Bebe, the comments. Oh my goodness. I have been laughing for days off the comments. That's number one. Number two, I thought it couldn't get no worse. But then she started uploading today and y'all had Caitlin dancing right up there next to the poem was throwing money at her. I mean, what does that insinuate? What does that insinuate? Come on now. We ain't dumb. This stuff is crazy. Then you wonder why that girl is growing up so fast. You're going to be on here on the next team mom in a minute with the way that you running things over there at that camp. Ooh, baby, where's the mamas and the daddies at? Because this is getting nuts. I had to make this video because I'm telling y'all, we look, it's the weekend. We need to unwind. Where's the party? Baby, I had to react on this because it just took me out the ballpark. I don't know what y'all thinking about this, but I can't wait to see y'all down in the comments below. I will see you there later.